Hi guys, this is a video on Windows software. This time I'm talking about controlling your PC from your mobile phone through Bluetooth. Now what you need is obviously a Bluetooth enabled mobile phone. I have my K750i here and this Bluetooth remote control application, if you just Google it, it's the first result. And you need to have a Bluetooth adapter on your PC so you can connect to your phone uh, from your phone to your PC. Now I've already uh, pretty much set this up, but I'm going to need to now install the phone client for it. So I just press install phone client and it says Bluetooth RC. I then need to send this to my phone. So I say send to Bluetooth device and next and you'll notice it will flash up. There we go. Incoming item from here. So we say yes, accept it, save it in applications, and it's saved. It says start now, yes. Uh, it's now saying loading. I can get this to show you. Allow application to create server Bluetooth connection. Yes, and it says reconnect. So I'm re reconnecting. A connection to a, a Bluetooth computer has never been made. So I need to search. As you can see, it's now searching. I th have a problem with my screen recorder. It sometimes lags behind. So I hope this isn't doing it for this specific one. See, it's found one and it's found HPC. So I'm going to select that, press yes to allow that. I've got a choice of PowerPoint, Media Player, iTunes, this is iTunes, Winamp, Mouse Controller, File Browser, Windows, Key Maps, and Disconnect. So if I show you the mouse controller, I'll just click it, and you can see that it's got my mouse and it's following it. So you can see it's it's, it's now doing a window inside a window inside a window but you can see it's controlling my mouse so I'm controlling it with my PC even so now I'm going to go back and if I can, oh yes back, here we go now I'm now going to go to iTunes, now you see I have iTunes open here, I've got a load of songs here what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a song so it says no active track if I go to play a song here it's going to play the first one just this one. You'll notice that now on my phone it's saying the song I'm playing and it's also showing the uh, timeline here. So if I press down it changes the track. As you can see I've got a load of rubbish songs but it's changing the track which is really really good. Uh, it, you can also do other things like rate the song if you want. Uh, if I pause it by pressing pressing the button in you can see it's scrolling the music across and if I go to uh, options or star here so it says by pressing 1 you can change the volume of it so I press 1 and then press down and then right or left and it will turn the volume down and if I put it all the way see about halfway I scroll as iTunes and you can see it's done the same there so it does it in real time so it's a very handy piece of software this you want to control your PC on your phone. So I won't show any more because this uh, video is probably lagging enough already. So that is Bluetooth remote control. Now unfortunately this application is shareware but you can use it and then it will disconnect you after a certain amount of time. Um, what you can do is get a freeware version called Blue Control which is available for um, which is available on SourceForge I believe so it's open source. I will provide the link to that in the description as well as a link to the shareware version. But as you can see I controlled iTunes and you can control the mouse through your Bluetooth enabled mobile phone. So it's a very handy piece of software, I'll include all the links in the description. If you know of anything better then please let me know. And um, please rate, comment, subscribe if you like my videos and thanks for watching.